Hi everybody, this is Bo Sanchez here at Preacher in Blue Jeans and I'm at the back of my house and I'm here in the garden. This is a tiny garden that I do not and have no ambitions whatsoever of trying to maintain it because I do not have a green thumb. I think I have a, I have a blue thumb or a yellow thumb, or, but definitely not green. I, I, I have no gift whatsoever for planting and you know, working with the soil, but some people do and I thank God that there's other people who are working on this garden and they make the plants grow and they do, they do mash the soil and they do water the plants and they do speak to the plants. But you know, the reason why I'm sharing that to you is because today is the 31st of December. It's the end of the year. And when you look back at 2008, not everything that happened was nice. You know, there was some pain. There's some of you I'm speaking to right now, you say, Oh, there's a lot of pain. There was a lot of pain. You know, and, and, and there's maybe bitterness and maybe resentment. And uh, there, there might be some, a, a, a lot of failures. You know, you, you failed a lot. You, you went through business failure. You went through school failure. You had a relationship failure. Uh, maybe there was sickness. Maybe there was, you know. And, and you look back, maybe there was sin in 2008 and you regretted doing that. But it happened. And, you know, so all this is there you know it's the end of the year and all of that is there and this is what I want you to do with it and I'm going to be praying with you on this I want you to take all of that your failures your pain um, your sin and you make it fertilizer you plant it into the soil make it fertilizer because whatever failures you've had in 2008 will be fertilizer for a great harvest in 2009. Because this is the promise of God. Romans 8, verse 28. You know this already by heart. All things work for good to those who love God. And if you love God, all things, that includes your failure, that includes your, 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 your pain, your sickness, it even includes your sins. As unbelievable as... as I mean, how in the world would you understand that? God says, God says, you know, do not sin. God says, I don't want you to sin. I want you to, to live a holy life. And yet, even in our sins, you know what God will do? He will take our sins and He will transform them. He will make them into fertilizer. He will, he will you know, fertilizer is supposed to be, supposed to be dung. It's, a, it's, it's not, it doesn't smell nice. It's, it's, it's dirt. But then it, it becomes something that makes your soil rich with nutrients so that in the next planting the harvest will be wonderful. And, and I'm going to share that to you. 2009 will be wonderful for you. Why? Because of the failures that has gone, you have gone through in, your, in this 2008. And it, it's difficult to understand that but that's how God works. That's how life works. The most successful people in the world are those who have the most failures. It's true. And so, take all of that. We're going to surrender it now to the Lord to enrich your life. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Lord, we thank you for every failure we've gone through in 2008. We thank you for every lesson we learned. And yes, Lord, we, we know, we know, Lord, that if we will not learn our lessons, we, 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 it will happen again. And we don't want the failures to happen again. We, we want to learn from your lessons. And we want to be enriched by every failure and every pain and every trial that we have gone through and even the sins that we have committed. We ask for your forgiveness and we ask you to cleanse and wash us and we surrender them all to you into your big hands and we want you, Lord, to be with us this coming year and we want your power and your blessing. Father God, we will make our failures fertilizer in Jesus' name. And we foresee, Lord, a great harvest, an abundant harvest. Hallelujah, in Jesus' name. Amen and amen. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. It is wonderful to pray. It's wonderful to be together. And brothers and sisters, I invite you to my family, uh, my virtual family. It's called www.charigmafamily.com. Be part of this family and start the year right. And we will give you, and you can download a mountain stuff of spiritual blessings so you can grow and be nourished in 2009. This is Bo Sanchez here in Preacher in Blue Jeans, nourishing your soul every day. I will see you tomorrow.